Eko de de asikoi. Hello everyone, welcome to ispeakyorubatu.com. This is your one-stop place for everything Yoruba language. Thank you for learning Yoruba language with I Speak Yoruba Too. Welcome everyone. My name is Eniola and you're listening to I Speak Yoruba Too. Shida Dalewa. I hope you're all keeping well. Right, today we will be learning all about numbers. Hmm, I understand that it's one of those boring topics. Unfortunately though, we cannot do without numbers in our life, can we? So we really do have to learn these Yoruba numbers. But guess what? I love numbers. <laughs> I don't like reading, but I love anything that has to do with numbers. I believe I'm the world laziest reader. <laughs> I just can't comprehend how people read for fun. But give me anything that has to do with calculation and yeah, we're good to go. So, let's do numbers. <laughs> In Yoruba Essential Knowledge Level 1, Lesson 19, you learned about the base numbers in Yoruba which are a total of 15, and now we're going to build up on those base numbers that you've learned. If you recall, in that lesson 19, it was explained that Yoruba numbers involve mathematics. Mm, yes, so you need addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division to arrive at a Yoruba number. <laughs> don't be scared, don't, don't fret. I know it sounds difficult. But trust me, it's not. Once you understand the basics, you will be fine. Okay? Let's have a look at it. Yoruba numbers are set into tens, more like decades. Okay? So you have 1 to 10, 11 to 20, 21 to 30, and so on. So at the beginning of every tens, a number addition is required. While from the middle of every tens, a number subtraction is required. Again, from the beginning, you need to do an addition and from the middle, you need to do a subtraction. I don't know if I'm making any sense to you. <laughs> so let's just get started and see what I'm talking about. Now we're gonna do the first 10, okay? One, two, ten. I won't bore you so much with this one because it is thoroughly covered in lesson 19. All right, so you can listen to it again if you need to. Mewa is 10. Remember that I said at the beginning of every tens, a number addition is required? Okay, 11 in Yoruba is mokonla, mokonla. Mokonla means one more than 10, okay? One more than 10 is Mokonla. Though the 10 is silent, we just say Mokonla. Muni bata Mokonla. Muni bata Mokonla. I have 11 shoes. Mejila. Me. Ji la. Meji la is 12. If you listen carefully, you can hear meji in the word, which is 2. Meji is 2. So 2 more than 10. Meji la. If we had 2 to 10, it gives us 12. 2 more than 10 is meji la. Meta la. Me ta la meta la meta la is 13 meta is 3 so meta la means 3 more than 10 okay mary la mary la mary la is 14 mary is 4 so mary la is 4 more than 10. Did you get the logic now from 11 to 14? You had 1, 2, 3 and 4 to 10 to give you 11, 12, 13 and 14. So you have 
mokon la, meji la, meta la, merin la. If you understand that, good. I mentioned earlier that at the beginning of the 10, you do a number addition. That is what we've just done. Now we are at the middle of the 10, the game changes. Now we do a number subtraction. Let's carry on. Marun di logun. Marun di logun. Marun di logun. Marun di logun is 15. Let me break this down for you. Marun is 5. D is to be less. Logun from 20. So, Marun 5. D is less. Logun from 20. Which is 20 less 5. Gives us 15. It might be a bit confusing at the beginning. I, I know. <laughs> Understanding Yoruba numbers requires some smartness. But once you know it, that's it. Okay? So, Marun di Logun is 15, which is 20 less 5. Marun di Logun. So, at the beginning of the first 10, you do a number addition. And then when you get to the middle, you start doing a number subtraction from the next 10. So, from 10, 11, 12, it's number addition. When it gets to 15, I am subtracting from 20. Did you get that? Okay, let's look at 16. Mary D. Logan. Mary D. Logan. Mary is 4. D is to be less. And Ogun is 20. Mary D. Logan. 20 less 4 gives us 16. So can you see how the subtraction and the addition is done? Okay, let's look at 17. Meta di logun. Meta di logun. Meta di logun is 17. Meta is 3. 20 is ogun. So 20 less 3 gives us 17. Can you see how it works? Meji di logun. Meji di logun. Meji di logun is 18. Again, meji is 2. So 20 less 2 gives you 18. Meji di logun. Mokan di logun. Mokan di logun. That is 19. Okan is 1. So 20 less one gives you 19. Mokon de Logun. Did you notice the use of the numbers 1 to 4? So when it's increasing, you had 1 to 4. When it's decreasing, you take away 1 to 4. So in the hopper way, 1, 2, 3, 4. Addition. Coming down, 4, 3, 2, 1. Subtraction. At first, it will be difficult, but as time goes by, you will come to understand it and it will be a lot easy and it will make more sense to you then. Okay? 20 is Ogun. 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 20. Now, the same logic that we applied between 10 to 20, we're going to put the same logic into 21 to 30. So remember, at the beginning of every tens, it increases, you do a number addition, and at the middle, you do a number subtraction. Now, 21 is Mokan le logun. Mokan le logun. Mokan le logun. Again, Okan is 1. Le is to be more, and Ogun is 20. So, 1 more than 20 is 21. More kan le logun. Me ji le logun. Me ji le logun. 22. Me ji 2. More than 20 is 22. 
Now, this is how it progresses until it gets to 25. So you have Mokon Le Logun 21, Meji Le Logun 22, Meta Le Logun 23, Mary Le Logun 24. Now, when it gets to 25, our subtraction begins. Now, remember the subtraction will be from the next 10, which is 30. Now, 30 is Ogbon. 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 So, 25 will be Marun de Logbon. Marun de Logbon. Marun is 5. D is to be less. And Ogbon is 30. So, 30 less 5 gives us 25. Marundi lodon. You can also say me dodon. Me dodon. 25. Mary din lodon. Mary din lodon. Mary din lodon. 26. Mary is 4. D to be less. Odon. 30. So 30 less 4 is 26. Mary de Lodon. Few tips of things to take note of when you're doing anything that has to do with Yoruba numbers. Know that number one to five is absolutely important because you need them for both the increase and the decrease in numbers when it changes. Okay? One to five, very important. Second, do whatever you can to retain the words le and di in your head. Le is to be more than and di is to be less than. So whenever you hear any number that has to do with le, you know there is an addition. And whenever you hear any number that has to do with di, you know there is a subtraction. Tip number three. Know that when there is a use of the word le, the number count goes up, as in 1, 2, 3, 4, upward. And when there is a use of di, the number count goes downwards, as in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. If you can wrap your head around those three bullet points, you will find Yoruba numbers a lot easier. Okay, let's do a quick run through from 11 to 30. See if you can count with me. Mokonla, Mijila, Metala, Merila, Maru di Logun, Mary di Logun, Meta di Logun, Meji di Logun, Mokon di Logun, Ogun, Mokon le Logun, Meji le Logun, Meta le Logun, Mary le Logun, Maru di Logun. Mary the Lord Bon, Meta the Lord Bon, Meji the Lord Bon, Mokon the Lord Bon, all Bon. Were you able to count with me? Well done if you did. So that is a run through from 11 to 30. We have done the addition and subtraction part of Yoruba numbers. <laughs> now let's look at the multiplication parts. This aspect is actually pretty easy. So the very first multiplication number in Yoruba is Ogoji. 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 Ogoji is 40. Now let's break it down. Ogoji. Ogo is taken from the word Ogun, which is 20. And G is taken from the word meji, which means two. So 20 by 2 gives us 40. So that is two 20s, we have 40. Ogun meji gives us 40. Ogoji. Ogoji. 40. That is the first multiplication number. Let's look at the next one. Ogota. 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 What can you hear from what I just said? Ogota. That is Ogun Meta. Like Ogoji. 
Ogo is taken from the Ogun and Meta. The ta behind it is taken from Meta. So we have Ogota. 3 by 20 gives us 60. Ogota. The same goes to 80. Ogori. Ogori. Ogori, which is Ogun Mary. 4 20s gives us 80. Okay? 4 multiplied by 20 gives us 80. Ogo re ogun me re eti. Ogo rum. Ogo rum. Ogo rum is 100. Ogun marum. 520s gives us 100. So 5 multiplied by 20 gives us 100. So this is how the multiplication goes up onto 200, which is Iba. 200 can also be Ogowa, which is Ogun Mewa, 10 20s. So 10 multiplied by 20 gives us 200. But it's not common. You would rarely ever hear Ogowa. The common uh, word you would hear is Iba. 200 is Iba. Take note that this multiplication only applies to the even numbers in Yoruba. So if you notice, we started with 40, 60, 80, 100, continuing like that up onto 200. Only the even numbers in Yoruba. I am sure that by now you must be tired. <laughs> so this is where we will stop with the numbers for today. We will pick it up again from where we left it in future lessons. But a little quiz for you before you go. Can you tell me what is Merrily Lodon? Merrily Lodon and Merrily Logoji. Merrily Logoji. Share your answers with me. I would like to know if you get that correctly. <laughs> if you don't get it at first, don't give up. Just dust yourself up and try again. Try again and again and again until you get it right. <laughs> Practice make perfect, they say, isn't it? So just keep practicing as much as you can and be smart. Yoruba people are smart. <laughs> all right everyone thank you so much for learning yoruba with i speak yoruba too and thank you for listening to this lesson that is all from any lot today and i'll see you all again soon Udabo.